Okay, we are in this Akdujong area and this place is famous for the... <laughs> are you? Well, in that case, I'm walking around. And you too. <laughs> because of the land value, uh, coffee costs more. Oh yeah? Costs more, yes. Yeah. Huh. Everything is expensive here. Boy, this is where we're eating, huh? <laughs> it's a good thing Iron Storm's paying. Yeah, but the same one in the US is cheap. For a new single speed? 80 bucks? It's not 80 bucks. No, Oh no, it's 800. Man, I did my math wrong, kid. That's too expensive for a new single speed. Still. That's a sexy bike. Sexy bike. Uh, too bad I can't do my math right. <laughs> Otherwise, that would have been a cool deal. <laughs> Good, we have two things of kimchi, right? This thing, kakuri. Oh, mmm. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh. Mm. Mm. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, trust me, yeah. Wise move. Yeah. I'm sorry, that's enough. I'm sorry, man. Yeah. Better than a shrug. Right now. It's not that bad. I think it's. Halfway decent. <laughs> well, for my last meal in Korea, we just had bulgogi, which I'm told is beef. I've also been told it's beef stomach, but really, once you've eaten down a live octopus, still moving around and grabbing at your throat, really about any of the part of the cow is, is going to be okay. Uh, finish up with some fried rice, some soup that I don't know the name of, and yeah, it's nice to know to leave Korea on. I think before it's all said and done, we're going to have a little bit more to eat. It's a country with uh, no shortage of uh, good places. Yeah. All right. Well, it's pretty cold out, but uh, you can't really call it a trip to Seoul until you've seen the Rainbow Bridge. One of the ten major bridges that uh, connects the north and the south parts of Seoul going over the Han River. What makes the Rainbow Bridge different, other than being two stories high, is that it lights up at night with a light show and a, and a water show. Really, really, it's a fountain that shoots out from both sides of the bridge. And it starts about, uh, about 8.40? Yes. Which is uh, just a few minutes from now. Seoul's a completely different city at night, uh, the way that the neon and, and all the lights just fire up. So this is a part of that and we're gonna we're gonna see it in just a minute here. Yeah. 
This is Shindangdong, Tteokbokki town. Do you know, Tteok Tteok you know what Tteokbokki Tteok is? We had it yeah. on the street. Yeah. And this is really famous town for Tteokbokki. They are all Tteokbokki restaurant. Tteokbokki then. <laughs> this Shindang Dong Tokbuk is really different than the ones you had in the street. Yeah, the ones on the, on the street was cooked already, but this as you can see, it's cooked before your eyes. Yeah, hot, hot spicy. <laughs> do, you, do you like hot spice? <laughs> and after three days, I think we had used to. <laughs> I think it matters whether or not I like it right now. <laughs> okay. It's all done. Hey Brandon. Ah. Oh. It's spicy. It's pretty good though. <laughs> Come all the way across the Pacific Ocean to eat ramen. It's a good idea. That's good? <laughs> okay. Yeah. It's called Tourist Context, sir. Hi, can you give me directions from the Koreata Hotel to Incheon Airport? Yeah, I know what the red light means. <laughs> I mean, stop doing what I was doing before you turned it on. Well, I'm ending this trip the same place I started, completely lost. I'm on a street in Seoul, there's bright lights, there's a ton of people around me. I don't speak a word of uh, Korean. I have no idea where I am. But just because it's sitting for me, doesn't mean that's in for you. In fact, there's two more trips to go, and if you get yourself onto SellYourSoul.com, you can enter. Apply to get, on, get onto one of these trips just like I did. Only a few applications in, that means the competition's going to start getting stiff. Sign up, come see what's last to offer. As for me, it's time for me to say goodbye, and konsamnida to South Korea. Yeah.